Welcome back to the Sports Update. It is my true pleasure to introduce two of the finest high school football coaches in the state of Michigan, Al Fricasa from Brother Rice. Nice to meet you. And yeah. Thomas Wilcher from Cast Tech. Nice Obviously, to nice to meet you guys. Both state championships for your program and, uh, and yours as well. So congratulations, first and foremost. To give you guys a sense real quick of how popular your names are, when I was working in Texas, I heard about <laughs> you guys. So kudos to you and congratulations on the state titles. Uh, obviously talking about getting ready for this uh, big prep football classic at Wayne State on the 25th, Division II, Division I state champs meeting for the first time, I understand, over there in this area. Mm -hmm. yes. So, Coach, starting with you, if you want to talk about just how much uh, you're looking forward to the real official kickoff of the football season. Well, you know, it's coming pretty fast right now. And uh, uh, these last two weeks, you know, have been uh, preparation time. And uh, we just got through with a scrimmage here. And uh, Tom did too. And uh, now, you know, officially, uh, Monday, we've got to go to work and uh, prepare for each other. So uh, uh, Tom has got a very good football team, and I think I got a bunch of boys that can play too. And how many returnees do you have coming back, Coach? We have about eight boys, uh, four on offense, four on defense, who played a lot last year. So. That's about as accurate as I can get right now. Sure. Coach Wilcher, obviously getting really excited yourself for the big matchup against Coach Fricasa. How are you looking? Well, looking at a, looking at a guy who's legendary, who's a mentor, talked to him several times from high school all the way up. I'm looking forward to playing against him. This, this, this is the second time we've probably ever played. Played once at the Pontiac Silverdome. This will be the second time right here. But I, I'm looking forward to the matchup because he has a very good team and uh, also I think the kids are looking forward to it also because they know each other, they heard about each other, they hung around each other all summer long, and I think it's, it'll be a fun game. How many? Oh, I'm sorry, Coach, go ahead. Go Because I think the kids are just excited too, just to be in a big prep showdown too, also. That's two of the finest programs yeah. in the state, and rightfully so. Mm -hmm. Coach, how many returnees do you have coming back this year? This year we have three on defense and three on offense coming back that's all we have but we have a lot of kids who played last year and so it, it, it's, it's gonna be a pretty good thing pretty good game well, also a special venue we talked about Wayne State the Detroit Sports Commission puts on this great event and I was told this is the first time that it's going to be in Detroit years before it was in Ypsilanti at Eastern Michigan University so what what kind of advantage do you think this gives kids now to play on the Detroit stage versus in Ypsilanti guys well we're gonna have a lot of high schools that are gonna come to our game and uh, they'll all be, uh, you know, rooting for us. And uh, uh, this is really uh, the last time we played at Wayne State was against Catholic Central. This is uh, two years ago. And we had a full house. And it was very, very well attended. And I, I believe this game is going to be very well attended also. Well, I think that uh, this game is going to be more than well attended. I tell everyone, if you got a ticket, you should get there the game before because you might not get in when our game come up. But I think that uh, being on this venue, it means that we have a larger crowd that can, who can attend. Yeah. You have uh, more people who have the opportunity to get to Wayne State versus Gypsilanti. Mm -hmm. And you have more high schools that's closer by that have an opportunity also to come to the game. So you, you will have a very, very young crowd and you have a lot of football buffs who want to see these two teams go at it too. And you have a lot of other games going at also. East Angeles Village playing, King High School playing, Oak Park playing. Southfield's playing, so it's going to be it's, it's a very good day, a very great, great day, I would say. Saturday, August 25th, 7.30, I believe, is when your matchup will take I place. I it's 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock? 7 o'clock or 7.30. Seven, well, yeah, either We'll seven. be there. <laughs> you get there early, <laughs> I know just in case. Uh, yeah, we'll be there early enough to play. <laughs> well, gentlemen, thank you so much again, and for more information for you at home, just go to DetroitSports.org to check out the specific timetables. Like Coach has said, 7, 7.30, it's all about the same. Get there early, a lot of quality football. Gentlemen, we appreciate you coming into the studio and sharing your time with us. Thank you so thank much. Thank you for having us. And best of luck this football season, okay. gentlemen. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay.